Coach has said that he he kind of worries about using you back to back, so he's going to find the right place to use you. And if it winds up being two, three, four innings, he's going to kind of ride the horse that brought him. Do you kind of like that rule where you go in, you're going to be in there until you get a job done? I like that. I mean, just getting out there and having the opportunity to pitch. I mean, whatever it takes to win. I mean, like Coach has kind of figured it out. I mean, I struggled early in the year, back to back days, and he's kind of figured out what it takes. You know, we've got guys that can you know come in any day and pitch. I mean. Since we've been doing that, we've been playing really good baseball and pitching well. And I mean, I mean, I've got confidence in the team to do whatever it takes. To win, you know? AD's been kind of adamant that you're the guy that they call a closer, but you have a lot of finishers too. You got Hunter, who's coming in and throwing three innings to finish games. Does that take the pressure off of you so that when you go out, you know that you're just out there to do whatever's needed? I mean, I'd say it takes some of the pressure off because Newman can come out there and, you know, he's going to do his job. He does really well. I mean, not only Newman, but all, all the guys. Zach Pearson, Newman, uh, Bug, Cartwright, Straw, Ball, everybody. I mean, they come in the pen and they come out there in the game to pitch. Like, you know they're going to do their job. So, I mean, I got confidence that the guys are going to do their job. And that time, you know, when it's my turn to come out there and pitch, that I'm going to do my job and I need to pick each other up. Yeah, I've heard both AD and, and Coach Maneri say that they don't ever tell you just one inning. They they just tell you go out and get out. Yeah, they said when, when they want you to go to the pen, they say get ready. And when you come into the game, you go into the game until we tell you otherwise. So, I, mean, I know with starters, they say we want nine innings out of you. You go out there and just kind of throw until my surgically repaired arms that falls off out here? I wouldn't say that. I mean, go out there. Like, you try to work fast. You know, you want to get mm -hmm. throw strikes and make, you know, the action happen quick. You know, four pitches or less. I mean, if you can do better than that, then you'll try. But, I mean, just go out there and get the action fast. Those strikes, make them put the ball in play. And if they don't, you know, strike them out. And if that's the case, you're going to be able to pitch longer and, you know, throw less pitches and be able to go longer. Seems weird to be asking you this in late April, but the way hunters come on, the way Zach's – what makes you unique in what you do? Because with Hunter, it's the curveball. With Zach, it's the way he can move the ball. What makes you one of the unique guys at the end of games? I think one of the things that makes me a little bit more unique is that I just throw over the top. And most of the other guys, you know, they have a three-quarter, a little bit lower. But I, they say I throw, like, right over the top. I mean, I don't know. Like, I can't see it. And I, I feel like I'm throwing from the side. But, I mean, they say I'm over the top. So I guess that's something to do.